question for you. Yes. So if a night at the museum type situation happened in the Natural History Museum, who do you think would survive? Good morning. Today we are in the lovely Hyde Park, crossing another thing off the list. So just in case you didn't know, uh, the purpose of this channel is that we're trying to do everything on Time Out's list of 101 things to do in London. Isn't that every intro? Well, just in case we've got some new people here, got to keep them in the loop. And we're gonna go check out the Serpentine Gallery, it's which I think cold. is like a an art gallery or something. I'm not really sure. So where are we, Andres? And where are we going? <laughs> Down here somewhere. <laughs> I'd like it to be known that it's a very crisp day. Is it zoomed in? I think it's zoomed in. There we go. I don't know what I've done with the settings. So I just realized that I've had the settings on wrong for the entire video, so apologies in advance. Everything was so blue. We're things here. aren't as depressing now. Yeah, things aren't as depressing in London as the blue hue made it seem. So what were your thoughts? It was really good. You liked it? I thought it was interesting and it wasn't too long, so it was basically a photography exhibition. Well, the Serpentine Gallery, I think. It's like they have every two months an exhibition for a certain artist. I didn't get it. I mean, it's almost like, for me, I'm trying to find a meaning to it. If I can't find it, then it's just like... I think art's meant to evoke an emotion, right? As well. Yeah. And so I, th I felt like a lot of the photos were kind of things that you wouldn't expect to see together, I found. It was good though. I I, I enjoyed it. What's his name? The Norwegian. Thornborn. Thorn Thorn John Thorn Rodman. <laughs> well done, Thorn John. <laughs> So we just came from that way, but apparently the Serpentine Gallery is this way. Because there's two. There's one called the Serpentine Gallery and there's one called the Serpentine Sackler Gallery. Which one did we go to? Serpentine Sackler. Ah! Second there, I thought we'd done completely the wrong thing. You know what? Like, Hyde Park is nice. It's nice it's, for a It's walk. not our favorite park, I'd say. No. We like Regent's Park. I mean, a lot of people come to London and they say, oh yeah, you have to go to Hyde Park. And I, Hyde Park is nice. It's, it's not Hyde it's, Park, it's Hyde sorry, Singular. Hyde Park is nice. <laughs> I mean, the good thing about London is that there's so many parks with different personalities, I guess. What would you say Hyde Park's personality is? I would say Hyde Park is like the queen. What? Over right here. Oh yeah. We saw this one. We just walked around the building twice, trying to find the entrance, but we found it now. So we're gonna go in. Thoughts? Didn't like it. Me neither. Sorry. I preferred the first one. So Andres just got this jacket just after it. giving me hell for having a leather jacket. What? And he loves it. You hate my leather jacket. Maybe I hated it because I didn't have one of my own. <laughs> it matched. We're in the museum quarter. And right now we're going somewhere that we've been before. It's actually a very nice architectural building. It's beautiful. So if you couldn't guess where we are, it is the Natural History Museum. Today is November 5th. I'm just gonna put it out there that I feel like it's way too early to have a Christmas tree up. People I do love Christmas. People are keen to get into the Christmas spirit. This is true. All right, should we go? Yeah. Let's do it. We're in line. I've never seen a line like this before for the Natural History Museum. It's a bit weird, but hopefully it'll go fast. This place looks like a cathedral. It's so big. You know, it's the most unflattering of angles. It's the hidden camera. My mom actually told me that the Natural History Museum, but she recalls something saying that she really liked it. It's Charles Darwin, that um, there's a quote saying that everything changes. And let's get on a mission to see if we can find that quote. Yeah? Do I have a reputation of being clumsy? Okay, so stop freaking out with me dropping the camera. Yeah, I do. I always do. But to do that, I need to grab it without it first. I'm so cold. We're in. We're in. It's, it was so cold outside. We were there for like 20 minutes. I've never had to wait in line before, but there was a line. Yeah, I guess population is increasing. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's one of the holidays. There used to be a diplodocus here. Like a, 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 Called Dippy. Dippy the Dippy. And now there's a... It's a whale. What kind of whale? A white whale? It looks like it's a humpback whale. Humpback. I don't know. We'll find out. Whale. We think we found the quote. It's my guess, but I don't think that's, I don't see a quote. Yeah, that's definitely not, not it. I just say, this is a little bit like being in Madame Tussauds, but for animals, is it called? The blue whale is massive. Like, this is true. the blue whale would not be invited to our flat in one day. I feel like we've seen this exhibition so many times. I know. I've been, I think we've been here at least five times in the past four years. <laughs> question for 
you. So if a night at the museum type situation happened in the Natural History Museum, who do you think would survive? I think the dinosaurs would probably be T-Rex? Yeah. Natural History Museum is done. And now we're going to our favorite, our second favorite bakery. I think Gail I might think be our more first favorite bakery. Favorite than mine. They make amazing she red velvet cupcakes. Did you like uh, Natural History Museum? It's my favorite museum, I love it. Is it? Yeah. It's your favorite museum? Yeah. So every weekend Andres does a pasta. Well, we don't have any mozzarella, so we're trying to find some mozzarella. But it needs to be good mozzarella. Yeah, the ingredients are essential. We have gone out of our way to go to West Hampstead to try and find this cheese. Better be there. Your pasta better be amazing today. That's all I'm gonna when say. When is it not? This is true. It's always amazing. The cheese is in the nest. The pasta is done. Andres is just about to join me. So we're gonna end the video here, but thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again soon. Bye.